hate so um i haven't been done this live stream for a long while and i've been thinking how can i how do <laughs> how do sharing the same things over and over from different angles help anyone but i realized that we are one and therefore we are in the same struggles if we want to be uh, acknowledging it or not and for me in this time what i feel a lot is i feel a lot everything there is everything that is going on i have these waves of fear and anxiety there is a lot of patterns coming up from the past where i feel completely lost even that i am more found than ever but because that we are connected <laughs> on such a profound level then when the world is in progress and the world is in chaos there is this part within us that will be triggered by this chaos if it's not fully cleaned up and out of course we will be a vibrationally matched to be a part of that so within this there is this profound feeling of loneliness and if there is something that the world reality is facing today it is that it is loneliness but it's also the duality within it it's also the being together i believe and i found it more important than ever that realizing that with every bad or low feeling and frequency there is always a high there is always a contradictory feeling so if you feel super bad about something you're also able to feel super good about the exact opposite what we doesn't have the ability to change in this now may be that we cannot change the person that we chose to be but what we can change and what i <laughs> am looking more into than ever is that we can change the way that we look at ourselves, the way that we perceive what we are, the way that we perceive the way that we are walking on earth and amongst each other. I said this once before and more than once. <laughs> In this time, it's so important that we accept each other and we allow each other to be what we believe we have to be within this moment. It's important that we um, don't try to force each other into make decisions that we are not able to or ready for making. Nothing that is not given freely is truly worth something. That has always been my perception. So <clears throat> if something flows and comes your way, if, if a choice is made from the heart without no pressure, then it's real. It's authentic. But the moment that we have to force other people to make a choice that they ain't ready to see, it doesn't have that feeling of flow and light within the heart. So even in these times where we need to stand up for what we believe in, stand up for human rights, <laughs> um, force is not the way. Forcing humanity um, to see <laughs> what they sh should see is in the way the only way we can change the world is by being that change ourselves the only way that we can find kindness within reality is being that kindness ourselves the only way that we can find the love within this world is by being love itself so <laughs> Being gentle to ourself um, is definitely something I have to work on, but also being gentle to each other. If we have anger, let it flow through the system, but don't let anger be the drive. If, if we have fear and God knows because he made it so, I got a lot of those fears. Allow it to be, but don't let fear control our lives, right? So if we could allow fear to be there to help us grow through it but 
still let the love in our heart be our guides. Imagine a world reality, world reality that we can create together. Yeah, so that was a lot of blah blah for today. And um, I guess I should get out because the sun is up and everything is light. I want to wish you a beautiful day and a beautiful Monday, I guess it is. And um, nights up with you soon. Doo-doo!